when I make my videos, my aim is not to offend you. What do I gain by offending anyone? I don't gain anything. I don't get happy when I make someone sad or cry. I don't. <laughs> Actually, to want to offend people is a sin. So why in the world would I jeopardize my soul for something really foolish? Think about that. So my aim is not to offend you because I don't gain anything from it. Nothing at all. Back in, I forget what year, 2012, 2011, I forget. Around this time period, I was in sin. I was lukewarm. I was dating this Japanese woman from Japan. And I believe she is or was Buddhist. And I did not really know much about what they are or whatever else. But the first time she came to see me, she was here for a month. Then the second time, she was here for three months. Because with a passport, I believe you can only come here three months at a time, I think. Anyways, either the first or second time she came here, she gave me some type of charm for my car where I could hang it on the window and she was saying that it is for protection or something like that or good luck and then after the second time I believe she gave me this bracelet and this bracelet had many beads in it. I believe they were energy beads or something like that. And she was saying that each bead means something. And I had no idea <laughs> about stuff like that. I thought that it is something average, I guess. I don't know. After we broke up, after a while, maybe a year or more, I forget, I wanted to get close to God. You know, I was hurt and I was in anger and hatred, not only for her, but for everyone, pretty much. <laughs> I hated everyone, even the people I never met. I hated you. <laughs> Crazy, man. Anyways, I wanted to get close to God. And when that happened, some really demonic stuff started to happen. Stuff that never happened to me ever, ever. My Lord. It was so bad where I could not sleep at all. 
So I had to move out of that place and move with other people. And what came to my mind was to toss out the things that she gave me, to toss it all out. I threw away some clothes, that bracelet, that charm thing for the car. I threw out all that stuff. What is your point, Kevin? Some things that we may do, some things that we may obtain, it may seem very harmless, but if it has nothing to do with God, if anything, For instance, that charm that that woman gave me, my ex-girlfriend, she said that it was for protection or good luck or something like that. That charm there, how can a charm protect me when it is not coming from God? That charm has nothing to do with God. So I am looking for that charm, that demon within that charm to protect me. <sighs> if you are looking for a higher power to give you some type of energy to give you some type of power, you have to understand that it is demonic. Kevin, I am doing this and I am going to heal people. I am going to protect people. Yes, it has nothing to do with God, but with this power, I can do so much good. Ah. ignorance any power outside of God I don't care how good it looks I don't care how good it sounds I don't care how many people say that it works any power outside of God is demonic I am telling you I am trying to tell you any power outside of God is demonic. Any power outside of God is demonic. So any type of protection spell or charm or anything you hang on your window or anything like that, any candles you burn for whatever reason, other than, of course, you can use candles to make your home smell good. But if you are burning candles to pray to a certain entity or for protection spells and stuff like that, it is demonic. Think about this. If those things have not had a long a long lasting good effect upon you, why are you still doing it? The only power you should be seeking is power from God. Stop playing around with this demonic stuff. If I would have known what my ex-girlfriend gave me was demonic, I would have told her no. I was wearing that bracelet with those beads, maybe not every day, but often. And I had that bracelet in my home. Demonic stuff. 
you know, I wore it because it looked pretty cool. You know, in America, I never really saw anyone wearing beads around their wrist or this bead bracelet. It was really nice looking. It had these different types of circular marble-like beads. Many things may sound good, may have a somewhat good appearance, but it doesn't mean that you should involve yourself in it. If you are meditating to anything that is not of God, my Lord, you need to stop. You need to stop. If you are meditating to anything that is not of God, you need to stop because when you are doing this, you are going to get much more demons and your life is going to get worse. Yes, you may get some positive effects at first, but after a while, I am telling you, worse things are going to happen because a demon can only look like an angel or whatever, or have this good appearance only for a short while. After a while, a demon has to show its true colors. It has to. It has to. For anyone else, I can act fake for only so long, but my true self is going to show. The more time you talk with me, you are going to know what I am about. Let me go down this other route. Sometimes with people I speak to, they can say all the right things, all the right things. And I am not saying that they are not going to make mistakes. But a person can say all the right things to you. But after a while, their true self is going to show. It have to. So all those things that they were saying about their self or themselves, I am going to see if they are telling the truth or not. Myself. Some people say, well, Kevin, how can I trust you? Don't. By me talking to you, by me doing whatever with you, you are going to see how I am. So I can care less if you trust me or not, because you are going to see my true character soon. So I don't waste my time saying that I'm a good guy or, or I am a Christian. No, you are going to see it by the way that I am. It is going to show. So if you choose to not trust me, hey, whatever. But you are going to see how I really am. So I prefer you to not trust me, to come to your own conclusion to how I am. That is what you are going to do anyway. <laughs> so I pray that this makes sense. Stay away from stuff, any type of religious, healing, receiving power. If it has nothing to do with God, you better stay away from it. This may be the problem why you have so many issues now because you are playing around with this demonic stuff that looks really nice on the outside. Stay away from it. Because if you continue to play with demons, play with demons, demons are going to play with you back. And you are not going to like it. So let me stop here. God bless.